I want to start this video with some unfortunate news. Our CEO, Josh, tried on his friend's Vision Pro, and he's just gotten stuck. He literally can't get it off. The solo knit band is just too tight. If you know anyone who can help, at Apple or elsewhere, please contact us, contact the team. We want Josh back. But in the meantime, there are updates in ARC we need to talk about. First up, I'm gonna kick it to Jane to speak about a big update we're pushing to Arc Search today. It's been three weeks since we launched Arc Search, and the reception has blown away our expectations. We have a big update today with three new features based on what you all have been asking for. First up, our most requested feature, shareable browse for me pages. Now, after you do a browse for me search, you can tap share and share the link with any friends, partners, or whoever you want. This weekend, I was at a party, and I heard some people mentioning an Annie Albers show here in town in Austin. Got this page of Annie Albers show, The Blanton. Tap the share button. Got my share sheet. I'm gonna send it on to her. All right, there we go. She can now view this page in Arc Search and any other browser on phone or on desktop. We all love the new and sexy features like Browse For Me, but we also just wanna make Arc Search the best mobile browser. So this week, we've added incognito mode, our second most requested feature. To use it, all you have to do is tap the eyes right there, you're in incognito mode. Tap back, you're out. Tap the eyes, you're right back in. Next up is a new feature called Pinch to Summarize. Arc Search is all about getting you the information you need as quickly as possible. With Pinch to Summarize, you can now do that for any web page you want. All you have to do is pinch, and it will remove all the ads and SEO optimized content, giving you the answer you need as fast as possible. I found this really good forum, right? It looks like it has a lot of people debating the nuances of pizza in Austin. I just want to know exactly where to go. Give it a pinch and get a summary. We've left a type form link in the video description here. If you have a few minutes, we'd love to hear how you're using Arc Search and how we can make it better. Now, I'm going to kick it over to Samir to talk about what's new this week in Arc on Desktop. Hey everyone, as always, we're working on tuning up the fundamentals of Arc on Desktop, and today's release is a great example of that. First up, we have an improvement to the pin tab behavior. Starting today, if you're on a pin tab and have moved to a different page within that pin tab, you can return to the original URL by command clicking on the pin tab icon. We'll bring you back to the original site and open the current URL in a new tab. Big shout out to Freddie for launching this feature. Next up, I want to talk about performance and stability. Over the past year, this has been a major priority of the company. And to be honest, the size of the team working on it reflects that. Nine months ago, our crash free rate was less than 97%, which isn't that great. I'm happy to say that now we're above 99%. While that's great, we are still working hard to improve. Our internal goal right now is to achieve triple nines, 99.9, .9, and we're working really hard to achieve that. Another example is a big performance win we had recently. We now use Metal on Mac for rendering web contents. We rolled this out to 100% for ARM machines last week, and we've seen huge improvements with respect to GPU crash rates, as well as some performance wins and battery savings. Big shout out to Justin, who launched this feature last week. Finally, this is a small and fun one. Thanks to Carla, Connor, and Jane, we have now added anniversary stamps to membership cards, so you can see how many years you've been a member on ARC. A huge thank you to all the members out there who've been on ARC for many years. This week's update really represents what 2024 at the browser company is all about. You've told us you wanted ARC everywhere you are, and we're working towards that goal. We're pushing a big update to our brand new mobile browser that brings the internet to you. We're focused on perfect stability in Arc on desktop, and we're also onboarding tens of thousands of new members to Arc for Windows beta, and we're ramping that up every single week. We're still a small team, and we can't do everything at once, but please continue to send in your feedback, and we'll be working on it as fast as we can. And if Josh can't get out of Vision Pro, maybe we'll have to bring Arc there as well. So see you next Thursday, and uh, please, please send us your tips. <laughs>